Firefighters in Fern Creek had to battle the cold along with flames this afternoon. They were called to a townhouse in the 5400 block of Haynes Trace. WLKY's Marissa Alter is live from there with what she's learned. Marissa? Vicki, the fire is out now, but it affected two townhouses here. One of them is vacant, the other is not, but no one was home at the time. When we arrived, we had heavy smoke coming out of the attic in the second floor area. Uh, we've got eight companies from three fire departments here, about 30 firefighters on the scene. It took us maybe 15 minutes to get control. Louisville Arson is now investigating, but their preliminary findings are that this was accidental, either beginning around a fireplace or dryer. They're not sure yet which unit the flames actually started in. Both share a common wall with all their utilities butted up against each other. That's something these firefighters say they see often. They also say the weather conditions didn't cause any real problems for them today. Yes, it was very cold, but the snow was cleared from the road leading up to here. They also didn't have to worry about snow being on the roof since crews attacked the fire from inside. The hydrant worked properly, no hose lines froze up, so we were, to this point we haven't had any problems. Now later tonight and the next two days it's going to be severely difficult with the below zero temperatures. Now, initially, Chief Schmidt did call for a warming bus, a tarp bus, to come here to keep firefighters warm. That was in the event that this fire got out of control and fire crews would be out here for a very long time. He ended up canceling that since they did get the fire under control fairly quickly. Now, we've also learned that the people living in that townhouse, which was damaged, will be put up in another unit around here by the complex. Reporting live from Fern Creek tonight, I'm Marissa Alter, WLKY News.